Uh, let's talk about why you need reds, why you need greens. They do very similar things but very different things as well, I guess. Um, reds, left, cut a left radius. Greens, right, cut a right radius. I'll just quickly demonstrate that now. So, using the, the reds. On the job site, we don't really call them left and right, so we just call them reds and greens. And now they're greens. And you start to know, you pick up a pair of snips and you were trying to do a cut and you go, nah, I don't want this pair, I want the other pair, and you just switch them out. So you're not focused on these are greens and these are reds as such. The other reason you use them is the way the jaws work. They'll push, they'll push your offcuts or push your material a certain way that you want to go. So if I'm going to fold this down and I knew I wanted this material underneath this side, I would use snip one reds, push the material under this material, and then I would come and use the greens. And that's push the material under this material and then it'll fold down. My material's gone where I wanted it, so I wanted this material on top of this, and this material on top of this, and the snips help that. And then you'll get into situations, and I wanted to cut from this corner, my snips can't get into it. The reds can't get into it. So then I would obviously switch them out for the greens. And then when I come to the other side, I want to cut down, greens can't get in there. The other option is I cut from the other way or I get the other snips.